my last first day of undergrad. Good morning, guys. I just got up, got ready. Obviously, this is the start of my... Oh. <laughs> Obviously, we're starting another college week in my life. If you guys are new, my name is Maria. Hey, welcome to my channel. I do a lot of college and like lifestyle videos. I go to Texas A&M University and I'm a senior and this is my last first day of undergrad. I would say it's my last first day of college, but like I'm trying to go to grad school. So we'll see how all that goes. Um, subscribe to see how all of it goes. Yeah, I'm really excited. Well, people have been asking and I've been like, oh, I'm not excited because I am it's a little scary, like, not knowing this time next year, like, what you're gonna do. But it's also exciting just to, like, be on campus. I have a whole semester of just, like, fun that I feel like that awaits me. And hard work, of course. But we're just trying to have a fun time. So I'm gonna show you guys my outfit, what I'm wearing today. I that it feels so good to be vlogging and doing like another college week in my life. I really missed it. So today I'm wearing this uh, crop top. I love wearing things with sleeves. I don't really like showing my arms that much. So I just threw on this cream crop top, which I think is like from Forever 21 maybe, or I'm sure you could find something like it there. These shorts that I've literally had forever. I think I got them thrifting and they're kind of, this is kind of like a game day moment, but I've never worn these shorts for game day and I've literally had them since like freshman year. So I'm just like, okay, I do what I want. I'm gonna wear these today. Last first day, best day. Um, and then just wearing some black sandals don't even know where they're from just just like regular basic black sandals and my hair is down right now but i feel like she's gonna poof up because it's so humid but she's looking very voluptuous shout out to first day girls yeah that's what we're wearing gigum also i have my aggie ring ha ha just been watching some i have just been watching some youtube this is abby aslan she's another college youtuber i think she goes to Alabama. Just putting this stuff in. I have my sketchbook, which I used to play in videos. So if I have like downtime, I put that in my backpack. Then my wristlet, I put that in there. And then she actually inspired me to bring some sunglasses because I always forget. And it's really true. Like you need sunglasses on campus. I need to put that in there. I guess I'll just go ahead and put it in there now. Sweet. <laughs> I drove to the Bucks, but this is one that like doesn't, also I put my hair in a braid because I need my hair to set some more. I'd been wanting Starbucks all day yesterday and I was like, no, you know what? Tomorrow's the first day of school, last first day. I'm gonna treat myself then. So here I am treating myself now. But I have to like walk in, which is kind of inconvenient, but it's fine. On my way to work, normal commute. Also, really quick tea. I saw that they had pumpkin spice latte out and like last time I checked, it's August 26th. I don't understand. Don't get me wrong. I love fall. Like, I'm the biggest fall supporter, advocate that you'll ever meet, probably. Like, I really am. I have, I'm so fall. But it's August 26th, and especially being in Texas, like, a pumpkin spice latte just, I would still buy it. You're gonna put it right in front of me, like, I'm going to buy it. But it just doesn't make sense because it's not even technically fall yet. Like, at least wait till mid September, I think. Starbucks, what are you doing? You know what I mean? That's all I had to say. I was just like confused and really shook whenever I saw the thing out, but we'll see. We'll see how it goes. This is why we don't play with college station traffic. I've been here for too long. This is Kyle Field. This is where the train goes. This is where I'm trying to go. That is my livelihood. You bring convenience. I don't know what's going on. I can't see. So we're just stuck. Just stuck and I hate that. Ooh, we're moving, okay. I can't swim. Oh, okay. I didn't know what to say. Hey, vlog. Oh, cute. No, 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 no. <laughs> I'm Coke. Let's do our intro. Yeah, do it. First week. Okay. Hi, I can't believe I'm gonna be watching this Oh. Video. Hello, Maria. In the video. Hi, Maria. Oh my God, it's Ethan. Alex does not care at all. Oh my gosh. Oh my. No. Oh. Coming home to my HelloFresh package. <laughs> Chill. As I'm back in the car. I've kind of been all around the world today, honestly. I went back to take um, a last first day picture for the gram and my mother. So I sent that over to her. I went to drop off something at a friend's house, talk to them for a little while. And now I'm at Chewy's. If y'all know what Chewy's is, it's like a Tex-Mex place. I'm there because it is my roommate or my old roommate's. Olivia's 21st birthday, so we're celebrating her there. I was listening to Gals on the Go 
Danielle Stillo episodes. That was good. That's one of my favorite podcasts. I don't know if I've like talked about that in the vlog, but I like am such a supporter of Gals on the Go because I feel like I'm a gal on the go. On it's pretty much an update. It was a good first day. I had one class, um, and my prof seems pretty chill. Oh, I it was super cool because I already knew someone in that class, which I had yesterday, and we are just very similar. So the girl. Um, who I'm talking about is Sarah. So she's in my class and that's cool and I met her friend too. I'll talk to you guys after dinner. Good morning, it's Tuesday. I haven't been to the gym. In a few weeks. Woke up earlier today on the way to the gym now. I'm not gonna do like anything crazy. Still groggy, still puffy. Yeah, I'm just gonna run and do some legs. Feel like I'll feel a lot better about the whole week after I do this. Happy to be up early. I love the morning time. And I'm gonna head to the rec center right now. Just came out of my workout. It was good. I ran like two miles and then just did like whatever kind of body weight exercises I wanted to do. And now I have like two hours into my class. I love mornings like these. I'm so glad that I woke up this morning. I was really dragging this morning too. I said, Oh, also, I'm listening to this podcast called What We Said. This is the podcast, and this one's about productivity and avoiding procrastination. It's two girls. I just love their conversations. It's really, like, conversational. Hey, I don't know that I've ever complained about how hot it is on the vlog, let this be the time if I have not done so. I'm literally so sweaty. It's just so hot. Just in Texas in general, the climate is just not for me, but here I am all my life. My gosh, guys, I'm finally home, looking a little bit disheveled, just looking a little bit out of sorts. But I think I'm just gonna stay in and like edit videos and make sure that I'm good to go for the rest of the week because time really does not let up. So I just wanna be like prepared for that rather than be behind and I think I just have to miss out. And then I'm gonna have to miss out on some stuff tomorrow too, which kind of stinks, but I think it's probably for the best. So that's my little update. I'm gonna go get a snack and then I'm gonna put the TV up and then I'm going to make actual dinner and then it's gonna be a great evening. I'm so excited. I think today I'm gonna make these for my HelloFresh. So I'm just gonna take this. Oops, I just take it out of the refrigerator like this in a little bag and it's honestly so convenient that it comes in the bag because everything's just here and it's so easy to handle. Good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning. Today's Wednesday. I don't have any more new classes. I've already been to all my classes. I do need to get on my online classes. I, I put in my planner to do that, like, um, later this week, just because, like, I don't, I genuinely do not have the time to, like, make it to the library and stuff, like, Mm -mm. That's just how it is. Ska. Um, just got ready. I'll show you guys my outfit in a second. Not super hungry because I'm going to meet one of my old friends from my first camp named Joseph. We're going to go to Einstein and Einstein's one of my favorite places to go on campus. It's just the Einstein Brothers Bagels, but like we don't have one at College Station. That's the only place I can get like a good bagel in town. So I like to go there and it's really out of my way, honestly, to go there on campus, but it's so worth it because it's just a peaceful time. So First off, I'm going to work, then I'm going to Einstein, then I'm going to class, then I'll go home, do some laundry, other stuff, housekeeping stuff, and now I'm giving the whole vlog away. So, just gonna show you guys my outfit, but I hope you guys are having a wonderful day because I think I am so far, and hopefully it stays like that. We're feeling good. I'm wearing my um, my high-waisted jeans that I got, like literally for $1 in Waco, my thrift store. Um, and then this shirt that I got, I believe, Oh, this is literally from Five Below, and then I cut it. It's not the best cut ever, but it looks cute with the shirt, or it looks cute with these jeans. And these these jeans are just so cute, because they're so high-waisted, and I cannot believe that I got these for a dollar. And then I've been wearing my big sunglasses on campus, which is kind of a moment and a look, so I like that with this. And then I'll probably wear just my Adidas, or maybe my Converse, or maybe my Vans with this. Maybe my Vans. This is what they look like. I don't really know how I feel about them. Like. The color scheme goes well. I kind of feel like I look like Danny Tanner with these on. So I decided against the Vans and I'm just gonna wear my Adidas cause they're safe and I think they just go better overall. So, cause they're not high top. So it's just a better, it's a better look. You know what I mean?
It's game day. Usually we have our games on Saturdays, but every once in a while A&M plans a game that's on Thursday and it takes a lot of planning and stuff like that. But kind of busted out of bed this morning and decided last minute that I actually was going to go to class. I wasn't going to go to class um, just because we do have a game today and it's still a school day. Like it's a regular, regular day. But I ended up being persuaded to go to class, which I feel like is probably for the best. Um, and it was chill, but now I'm going to head to the rec center because I don't have to go to work today. So instead, I'm going to get in just a quick workout and then I'm going to go and have myself a rest of the day and get ready for the game. I'm back to admit defeat really quick. I literally went to the rec parking lot. First of all, I beat the train, so that was pretty savage of me. Then I was trying to get my pods to connect and they've been acting up. So long story short, they didn't connect, so I'm not working out. And I'm just going home, going to eat some lunch and take my time to get ready because I feel like that's actually my best interest. I'm going to be sweating a lot anyways later, so... We're gonna be feeling skinny, and that's okay. I'm gonna show you guys what I'm wearing. I decided just to go really simple, really game day attire with the maroon jersey, okay? Two high-waisted shorts that are actually from Maroon 21. Can we believe it? A&M socks with the Adidas. Threw this on to be more festive, this like tie necklace. My hair, I just curled some of it. A lot of it's natural. Ready for my last first game. We're playing Texas State. Um, so it's just one of those games we'll probably, uh, probably win. Oh, I also have to put mascara on still, so. Cool, but I will see you guys at the game. We're so excited. Friday so on the schedule today we have work class gap today actually is the first soccer game so I'm assigned to take photos for them this season and I did it last season so it's, it's pretty chill and laid back I was just checking to see make sure that all my editing programs are on my uh, computer and they're still working fine because tomorrow is like a day that I don't have a lot I'm so pumped about it okay <laughs> From school tomorrow I get to go to brunch with my friends and then after we're gonna grind using my weekends like during the day instead of just like vegging out I'll make myself feel productive so that I can actually do stuff and like get ahead that I'm drinking my coffee right now um, because I'm about to take a nap <laughs> and I feel like this is a hack like I feel like I read this somewhere but also it's just something that I made up the cup of coffee before I take a nap and then I take a nap and I feel like the caffeine sets so that way whenever you wake up we're 30 to like 45 minute nap um so then the caffeine sets during that time while you're sleeping and you wake up and you feel like rejuvenated which is what i need when i low on time but i still need to like drink coffee i think i also just want to say that i'm just sitting here like chilling out enjoying like moments of bliss by myself and i know i always talk about loving being by myself and i do because it can be a super busy jam-packed day but there is a lot of um, appreciation that I have for realizing that it's a moment when it is a moment. And I feel like that's been happening more and more because I know that my time here is limited, my time here in school. So like when I'm on campus or when I'm just in a lull break that I have during my days, deciding what to do next, what to put into my schedule, I'm like, oh, this is a moment, this is a moment, this is a moment. When's the next time I'll have one? I don't know, but I'm just gonna enjoy it right now. And I feel like it just helps increase your mood and like bring you back to like, ah, like I'm still here, I'm still in one piece. That's all, I'm gonna go take a nap now. <laughs>